God bless you and welcome back to the CP Squared Podcast. I'm not the host, Justin. I'm Chris. I'm Lucas. I'm Dom. Why do we go that way? I don't know. I don't know. Lucas, you haven't been on a podcast in a minute, though. That was a lot. Can you name the episode that I was on last? Can I name it? No. I'm going to yeah. be honest. The mic is very low, so you're going to have to definitely put it in your mouth. <laughs> yeah, somewhere Whoa. like that. Hold on. I think the last one that you were on was, I think it said, like, goodbye, Lucas. <laughs> what the fuck? No, nah, that was, like, when I left to Orlando. Yeah. There's definitely one after that. There was one, I think it was, um, I came down, I think. I knew you came down for a couple of them. I think it's yeah, been I in, like, the, th- the 30s. What are we at now? We're at, this is 85. Oh, my oh God. Oh, my God. Yes, sir. Nice. Damn. Remember almost what? almost at 200 subs. 191 subs as recording of this episode. Which, speaking of that, hey, nice. if you're one of the 800 people that listen to this on Spotify, we have a YouTube channel. Come over here and watch us. Yeah, for the live feed. You know you can do videos up on Spotify? Yes, I've started doing that now. I, I, I didn't realize that. I didn't realize yeah, didn't that, I I didn't realize that until that. I started watching Joe Rogan's podcast. Yeah. Well, he had a. I think he was the first video podcast yeah. on Spotify. Yeah, of course. He, Spotify was paying him like $4 million of video. God, Joe I, Rogan. Oh, God, what? I wish. I wish. Yeah. Joe Rogan was is like the highest podcast highest grossing podcaster or something stupid and i watch like maybe one percent of his videos i don't think i've seen any of his videos i don't think i've seen i've seen all the ones with elon musk and um (laughs) i watch the ones with comedians i've seen a few of those andrew schultz hilarious yeah i fucking love andrew schultz well and um fuck go ahead well i was gonna segue off but if you wanted to keep going uh, I couldn't think of any of the other ones off the top of my head. A lot of nutrition stuff, honestly, because... Yeah, yeah. And, like, the hormonal stuff, because, honestly, I was, like, very close to getting on test, or trends when I was here. Not yeah. trend. I wouldn't do trend. I'd probably do, like, DMCA or something, or, DC, or, DC, or DECA, I think. DCMA. What are you talking about? DC uh, steroids. steroids. Get YMCA. Ah. Um, so I would have like, gone with te- trend. Test, no, because testosterone and trend are, like, pretty... I, what's his video? Do you know D-Trent on TikTok? Yes. So he's no longer D-Trent. He switched off of testosterone and Trent. Because okay. it's a very dirty hormone that'll, like, fuck up your libido, like, make you sad all the time. Um, like, it's not... And, like, make you break out in acne and loose hair. He switched to DECA, which was much more common in, like, the golden heard, age of bodybuilding. Deca's really... Yeah. You know. So, like, you're happy all the time. You have good sex drive. You don't lose hair. You don't break out in acne. Um, and it's, like... Uh, it doesn't revert to estrogen as or something like that. I forget what, exactly what he said, hmm. but right, like, it doesn't give you man boobs when you wane off. Yeah, of yeah, 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 yeah. So, way better, way fucking better if you want to be on the juice. Like, I, I would take that. I have a good segue. Okay, go Justin on. was on steroids, uh, not last week, the week before, right? Uh, uh <laughs> yeah. You put it in your butt. I was about a week ago. Put it in his ass today. And it was all my fault. What your fault? You what you trying to make pasta again? No, <laughs> no, no. We went to the beach and I brought that like oh. tanning oil sunscreen <laughs> that's like SPF four, but really it's just like fucking olive oil in a bottle. Oh, on your skin. And yeah. he put it all over himself. He's like, yeah. I was like, oh, it'll make you tan. He goes, yeah, tan. And then uh, we left the beach like red. Yeah, he nice. was a lobster. Nice. Yeah. I I got sun poisoning. There's actually a um. There's Hell's a itch. there's a hormone Hell's you can itch. take. That's, hey, he's back. There's a hormone you Justin can take hit him. that suppresses your hunger and makes you tanner. Oh my Justin god! Justin hit Justin, it again. You're him off. If he comes and hits me in the forehead, I'm gonna be so upset. Yes, the bubble. Justin, just turn, just keep turn it on for a while. It, it's a button switch. I can't just. Leave oh, is it, it on. really? Yeah. Tape it down. Yeah, we found out buttons get rid of mosquitoes, and since this podcast is outside, you mean bubbles? Bubbles. Here we are. Uh, woo. Excuse me. I hope that's a three-second clip you make. All right. Yeah, I'll make that a short. That's funny. Okay. I burped during that, too. Perfect. I said excuse me, I was on steroids for, uh, it was supposed to be six days, but I took them for two. (laughs) Do you have a low test? No, no. No, you took um, them for, like, a good three days, four days. It was two or three. You started them on, like, a Wednesday, and then you stopped taking them on Saturday when we were drinking at my grandparents'. Correct. Sounds like a good day to stop. Yeah. He yeah. said he, he was the whole drive up there. He's like, we're not. I'm not drinking because I'm on the steroids. And I was like, okay. I'm, 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 I'm on the roids. I bought a pack of tequila seltzers, which are great. 
And um, see, I looked at the camera. Anyways, um, we're learning here. They're really good. Only on and episode 80. Justin was like, yeah, I'll drink because my brother had beer and my brother was just like, Justin, come on. Also, my nephews called him Jordan all weekend. That's funny. Yeah, nice. They, they were the kind of steroids that don't make me stronger. Mm, so not the good but ones. Like, what? What, Babe, what were they called? Um, they, so what were you taking? He was taking um, prednisolone. Okay. It was. It's. They just it's make a steroid my organs that helps with. Better. It's a steroid that helps uh, with itch. It's not. It, was, it doesn't help. So with it's technically, a really strong anti-inflammatory. Pretty much. Nice. Yeah. Okay. It's an anti-inflammatory, but it's it's a steroid. I I asked the doctor two questions. Will it make me sleepy because I drive for work? And he was like, no. And I was like, cool. Can I drink beer? And he was like, no. It'll compromise your immune system. And I was like, aye, aye, captain. So you abided for like four days. And then I didn't drink. Well, I didn't drink since, you know, like Monday. Or, <laughs> or Monday. Yeah. So, sun, Sunday or something. <sighs> then we I drinking then I got, on Sunday at the beach. Then I got the itch, the hell's itch and sun poisoning. Didn't drink, obviously. Okay. Uh, went to the ER, got the pills, and then I was on the pills for like two, three, four days. And then I got, I think, me and your brother killed a 25-pack. And then they bought another and one. And then we bought another 12-pack and killed that. Meanwhile, I was just hanging out with my I was just fishing shelters. on a dock. Nice. Yeah. It was fun. Good times. It was a good weekend. Hey, speaking of drinking. Yeah? Lucas. Yes. You want to take a hypothetical question? Oh, sure. God. I love hypotheticals. So, Lucas. All the shorts on this that I've seen from this podcast are hypothetical. <laughs> yes, sir. Oh, my God. Lucas, you've got two fingers. Sorry. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> we talked about that. You can later. dispense any liquid from each finger. What are you picking? Oh, God. What was, what was the one that was said earlier? Well, like, Justin's did club soda and uh, r- the root beer syrup mix to make vodka tonics and root beer, which I found out, Justin, from Cody. That club soda isn't used in vodka tonics. It's tonic. It's tonic water. Oh, oops. <laughs> it shows you how much I drink them. <laughs> never. I don't think I've ever had a vodka tonic. Never. She even said that she she's can never I, seen you drink a vodka tonic. Does it have to be a liquid or could it be like... It has to be a liquid. Nah, for you it can be a plasma state. What? <laughs> well, like, what if I just had like infinite... Uh oh god! What are the puff bar from my finger so I could just stick it in girls' mouths at the club? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, that's so fire! No, it's not. I just suck on my finger like a that's moron whenever so I want to get a nick buzz. That's so fucking funny. Can you imagine? Suck oh, my that, finger. That swear. Would be fire. Swear. Swear it'll get you nick buzz. Suck my finger. Swear. Hey, yo. You know what's funny? I, most, what's funny too most is drunk girls would probably do that's it. That's what I was to, just about to, to say. To just like, oh, okay, this guy's fucking being a goober. They probably oh, would. Oh. If I was drunk enough <laughs> and I needed some nicotine, can you imagine and some like, can you imagine like, like my knuckle can, lights up? My finger. Oh my god! <laughs> you hit the blinker on your knuckle. <laughs> you know what? Can I change my answer? Can I have a cart here and nicotine here? Dude, yeah, that reminds dude. me of that fucking meme where the guy goes around with a USB port and being like, "Yo, you want to hit it in the club?" And the guy I goes, "Was it like yeah. UCO?" And he hits like a USB, <laughs> literally just a USB fucking plug. So you would pick nicotine and what? I don't, know. I don't know. They'd have two of them. <laughs> two, two girls. Yeah, two different flavors. <laughs> two different flavors. Watermelon. This one's black ice and this one's kiwi strawberry. Yeah. yeah. Wow, our flavors. Yeah. What the fuck? <laughs> tell me about. Tell me about this job. You got uh, a new job. How was training? Yeah. Training was. So I, I this did nothing. Is, so famous trucker people. What the fuck? That makes no sense. I don't what was know. I, it's a podcast where here? you quit jobs and start new yeah, ones. Yeah, that's what so. I was trying to say here. Tr- uh, people with CDLs just quit jobs all the time and get new ones. Yeah, especially, but like, especially but like, on this quit, podcast. I quit my Trans Am job because I got an offer from somewhere else to work. That's normally how it is. Yeah. I was a special reason. Yeah. You just w- didn't want to I wanted to, to kill that. myself. Yeah. I mean, dude, like, I'm not going to lie to you. After coming home, like, I fucking hate being on the road. <laughs> yeah, it sucks. You, like, you like miss it, but you well, don't. Well, like, okay, you know? so I went to New York. And then I got back on the road, and I was like, oh, this ain't that bad. And then when I came home, and then I got back on the road, and I was like, fuck, I really want to be home right now. Dude, yeah. it felt like you were on the road for, I swear, like maybe six three weeks. months. It was six weeks. I didn't come home. That's like a it month and a half. It didn't feel, I have like a really good Dude, I swear to God, that felt like feel two like months. Long. I felt like I just saw you like last week. Six weeks. He went, he's, he's, the, he's done a longer stretch than me. Yeah. Did he? I do three weeks at a time. Oh. Well, my longest stretch was 25 days. Yeah, but how many months did you do it for? I did it for four months. 
Yeah, well, he, yeah. Just, he, he just got but, sick of it quick. But I, but I didn't. Uh, but I took home time in that six weeks. It's not like I wasn't. It's not that I didn't come here for six weeks. I, I went to New York for right however many days. So what was your longest stretch without, bo- like, uh, with home time without home? What you know what I mean? Because your New York was technically home time. Yeah, I just like stopped. Was Wait, that home time? I don't remember. You did a reset time. in New York. I did a reset in New York. I did a reset in Georgia. I did a reset in Kentucky because that fucking company had me stranded for a day and a half. Kentucky. Sorry, yeah, dude. I fucking I dropped a load out of Walmart, and I told them that I was like, like, yo, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm an hour from the plant. I'm gonna drop it off. Have a load. Dropped it off. Didn't hear for them until like nine, ten a.m. the next day. That's bullshit. Fuck that. I mean, I went to sleep. It happens a lot. Yeah, it happens a lot. Well, like, they were like, yo, if you tell us in advance or, like, you request a pre-trip information, like, we'll send it to you. And then I was like, all right, move. They were like, move, like, a quarter of a mile to this truck stop because I just parked in a dirt lot. <laughs> um, no, okay. I was like this really small, shitty town, and there was, like, a little um, Mexican uh, restaurant uh, with, a dirt, with a huge dirt lot. And I was like, well, the truck stop's full, or that truck stop's full. That truck stop's probably full. And I'm here. Fuck it. Might as well sleep. So, I sleep there. I wake up. I leave. I putt over to the truck stop. I could have done it off duty. Um, I was gonna say, did you do it off duty and just? Hazards? I had to go on like a main road. Okay. Um, ah, hazards. I wasn't gonna do that. And then uh, that sounds illegal, it's Justin. 10, it's nine or ten. I I, I drove uh, I drove twenty five miles off duty. In what? In traffic. Oh well, you you were yeah okay okay yeah I've done that too. But not 25. I mean, it might have been 25 miles. Are you not supposed to do that? Yeah. So it's like, a gray area. So, you know what? You know what's fucked? Is apparently the brand new trucks, the second they roll, they'll flip you into drive. Really? Yeah, that's what, uh, at my training, that's what they were telling me. They're like, bro, some of the new trucks are fucking quick with it. You can't even roll with that bitch not going into on duty. The, the, okay, so disclaimer and some explanation. Wait, wait, for, let me, let me finish what I was saying about the trucks up. I get to the truck stop. It's 10 a.m. I call my dispatcher. Yo, when the f- and they're, they were going to swap me trailers with somebody. Yo, when the fuck is this guy going to get here? 7 p.m. Oh, my God, bro. Huh? Oh, and what time were you there? 10. I was there at 9.30 in the morning. Oh, my God, bro. So I wait around. Guy doesn't show up till 8.30. He's pulling in. I, I see the... Because, like, I know what the trucks look like. I see Trans Am trucks, Trans Am trailer. I'm like, all right, cool. I'm going to go... I probably shouldn't say their name. Whatever. Um, I don't you don't work for them anymore. Yeah. Um, I, I, I unhook my trailer in a spot. I'm like right in front. You see me when you come in nowhere else is like, I don't want to say nowhere else, but like T680, like you assume it's transit. Um, I unhook my trailer and as I'm on here, boom, like loud as fuck. I'm like, I hope that wasn't my guy. <laughs> I hope that wasn't I unhook my, my guy. trailer. I unhook my trailer. And then like this truck stuff has a confusing ass parking lot. So I just like, I drive around for a bit and then I, I drive in. And I find him, and he's, like, walking around with his two hands on his head. Fucking universal sign for I fucked up. Oh, uh-huh. no. Universal sign for I uh-huh. fucked up. And I'm like, yo, what happened? He goes, fuck it. it fucking hit a curb or the fucking concrete pole shit. I couldn't, couldn't see it. I'm like, uh, okay. All right, can't be that bad, right? And I look. I'm like, eh, it's not that bad. And then I, I have pictures. Um, But the skirt, like, the arrow skirt was, like, kicked in. Ooh. Oh, the, man. And then I look, and then the, the, the tire is, like, really far from... Because, like, the doubles, the tire is, like, really far away. I <laughs> get, bro, the wheel is like this. <laughs> oh, no. Like, destroyed oh, the rim. Absolutely destroyed the rim, tire off. That dude was coming in high. And then I look, I look under, because, like, the, the arm for the sliding tandem thingy, like, it was down. I was like, what the fuck? The frame was literally kinked. Oh. Like, it was like this. So he, t- he totaled. Yeah, he totaled. No, no, the tandems. The, he just fucked the tandems. Didn't fuck up, like, the actual trailer. Oh, okay. Okay, he didn't, so, he didn't fuck up the slides? No. So okay. I'm like, all right, cool, man. Sick. And then I call dispatch. And I call. Sick. Call breakdown or whatever. You make like, eight phone calls. Like, all right, stand by. I'm like, suck my nuts. <laughs> stand by. <laughs> fuck. I go back to sleep again. I've had one mile on my day or for, like, the past two days. Oh. And then I'm like, I go back to my trailer. I rehook. I just hook to it. I don't. I don't raise the landing gear or hook my airlines. Just hook to it so nobody steals it. And then I wake up and they're like, "Hey, so um, go to this address, Bobtail. Bobtail means no trailer." I'm like, why? I'm like, what the fuck? Why? He goes, "Oh, so you, we're we're gonna send a donor trailer to you, so we can swap the tins on the other trailer, so you can deliver that load." Why? I have a good trailer. Don't relay me. 
just let me go get another load so I can go home. I was I was supposed to be home like the day before. Right, right. Um, and so I had to go sit at this record yard. I watched them swap the tandems, and they're like, "All right, B, go go three hours north." And I have three hours left on my clock. Good luck. That's bullshit. I made oh it. Oh my god. I made it. I dropped that bitch off on duty. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Fucking okay. And then I, I like rifle. I tried to rifle home, and then I got stuck in um, fucking Jacksonville after doing a pickup for like three hours, and they finally sent me home. Is that what it's like being a truffer? You just get fucked. Um, sometimes. Most of the time, it's nice. I think it was just like the planner. I don't know how. I, I'm not sure how it works for Trans Am, but when I was after, because I think I had like 24 hours in New York, or like 30, 36 hours in New York. When, 70 hours in a me. week. He called me. And the the northeast planner called me. He's like, "Hey, are you at your truck?" And I was like, "Nah, like, I, my load wasn't until this many hours away." He goes, "Oh, okay. I'm just making sure because I'm the northeast planner. I just want to make sure what you're doing." I'm like, "Oh, yeah, I'm not on my truck." And he goes, "Oh, okay, cool." So I assume when I was in the southeast, because northeast guy, northeast guy, and the Midwest guy kept me running. Southeast okay. planner probably really hard to find loads because what the fuck comes out of the southeast? Basically, yeah. 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 So. Well, I mean, it's reefers. So. Yeah, it's reefer, and I can do dry loads too. Oranges. Sorry. Okay. I mean, I did Thanks lemonade. For your input. I did lemonade. I did. Oh wait, really? Yeah, I did. I did a lot of lemonade. I did like yeah. I did like forty-two thousand pounds of lemonade oh out of Jersey. God. Holy shit! Yeah. Um. See, I wasn't that off. So I wish like, I knew what I hold. I just assumed that. Well, you hold like electronics. Ah, uh, yeah. That's what they I don't told. Know. That's what I they hold, told. I hold. I hold a load for Comcast. I don't even know. It was just. What the fuck? Yeah. Or no, Verizon. Was it Comcast or Cell phones, probably. I, I boxes. have no idea what it was. I have no fucking idea what it was. It, it was lithium. heavy. It, it looked really light, but it was really heavy. Do you, did did um? Some did you order. have not your endorsement, but your permit to haul hazmat? There's two different things. Nope. Okay, then it <laughs> probably wasn't phones because yeah. phones have lithium batteries, and after a certain amount, no, it this is, is tropical hazmat load. Oh, uh, tropical had, Angry Orchards. You want to try it? Oh yeah. Do did you also have your alcohol and liquor per- permits? Mm. No liquor. I barely know her. Okay, so <laughs> Justin, I quit. Tropical Angry Orchard. I've had it. It's it, good. It's. I'm okay. It's thank okay. you. Yeah, it's kind of mid. So I quit, <laughs> and then this Wednesday I went to Winter Haven to start for a new company, and they haul only tankers, strictly tankers, food yes. grade. It's all food grade stuff, but um, you know, all orange juice, water, milk. Orange peels and whiskey concentrate. Orange peels? Orange peels? Whiskey concentrate? I'm glad you questioned that one, too. Yeah. like That was the only weird one out of the yeah. whole so thing. Like, okay, wait, wait. So the only reason I know that is because apparently orange peels are flammable, so it's hazmat. Oh, I've heard about this. Yeah. Oh. Because it because that that's a bar trick. If yeah. you take an orange peel and, and you... S- fucking AC unit? Yeah. yeah. And if you squeal, if you, like, squeeze an uh, orange peel, it'll, like, with a lighter in front of it, obviously, it'll shoot sparks. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, you it's kind of it's kind of dope. Yes, we do. Actually. Whiskey concentrate as well. We okay. do like all the big refineries, and then um, bubbles, the Justin. They're back. They're coming uh, back. I'll bubble it up. Continue. What else? I think we do um Pepsi and Coke products. Maybe I don't know. I don't fucking know. But it's nice because my all of the loads for this company are no touch freight, and uh, they're dropping hooks pretty the much. The best kind. I don't have to. I don't Dude, even have to pump the trailers. Machine is so fucking loud. There is an incentive. If you're a pump guy, you like stay more localized, but it is seventy five dollars per like time you have to, you know, pump the load out, but <laughs> Sorry. look, the bugs are gone. Oh, there's one chilling You get seventy five dollars to pump the trailer? Yeah. You also so like we also run Canada and if you have your um Yeah. You get two hundred dollars for crossing the border loaded. Also Whoa, you don't, really? you don't yeah. exactly need your passport. Yeah, you, you can get the, the card. Yeah, you can get your card, and yeah. um, I'm sure they told you. Uh, you can go same day without showing your card uh, if it's only within 125 miles and if you leave same day. I don't know what I don't know what the, the thing is. Unless it's different for tankers. Dude, that, that card Schneider. is super cheap to get. It's like 20 bucks. Yeah. Yeah, but you have to have a passport to get it. Yeah. Dude, well, you got one. I don't, I don't know. know. You don't have a passport? Out of the country. Well, like, I have one. It's expired. So uh, it's still easier oh. for you to get one. Yeah, yeah it is. You all you, all you have to do is send a photo and, like, and just pay. No, no, no. I have yeah. to get like a whole new book. My, uh, my shit's been expired since like 2014. Oh, got it. Mad no, expired. No, I think you can still. You just have. I, they're going to give you a new. When you renew it, they give you a new book. Wait. I'm in like the process of renewing it right now. It's like hundred and. Wait. Dollars. Those things expire. Those take 10 years to expire. You've had it for 10 years? He went out of the country like I super early. I had dual citizenship. 
Yeah. yeah. Oh, you did? Yeah. Oh, that's fine. Wait, where? With who? Brazil. That's awesome. It's actually a really you good... You speak Portuguese, too? No, I wish. Oh. It's actually a <laughs> really good... She had that good... relation with Bruno the other day. Yeah. yeah. Well, my dad my dad and my mom both speak different languages, and they're not even from the same, like, dialect. So, like, my, I don't learn, know a second language. Ooh. When I was, so, do they speak to each other in no, Portuguese? Dif- no, different... Like, they speak different languages, and they're from... They originate from different dialects. Oh, I thought you said they're from the same country, but they speak no, different dialects. No, no, no. Dialects. So, my dad... My dad... My dad was Dutch. He spoke Dutch. Oh. That's awesome. And my mom is... Brazilian, so she speaks Portuguese. Huh. Damn, so, so how the in- fuck did you get English? Um, I was born in South Miami Hospital. Uh-huh. <laughs> you were born in Miami? Yeah, I was born in Miami. Damn, then the you should have learned Spanish at that point. I'm from Miami, I'm actually from Miami. So. Dude, I didn't even know that. Yeah. I was born down the street. I did the same. I was born in South... My parents' like first house is worth like one and a half million dollars now. It's in like what? the heart of Coconut Grove. I Bro, think that, I hate driving to Coconut Grove. Dude, I think the house that our grandmother just sold was like seven hundred thousand uh, dollars. He, Todd, sold it um, for five twelve. Wait, how much did I say? Did I say half a million? Uh, you one said point, one point five. five. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, he sold it for five twelve. Oh, he could have got more. The house? Well, no, it has termite damage. It needs a new roof. There's holes in the kitchen and the bathroom. Guess not. Um, like, that's about two hundred thousand. Like not just like termite repairs. damage on the door frames. Like the entire house probably needs to get knocked down. Like the walls and shit. Yeah, it's bad. Mm. Remember the Florida room was all wood. Why yeah. Did go, why did it get oh. so bad? Termite oh. damage. Uh, because the no one's really upkept it. In well, like fifteen twenty years. Well, because huh. when our grandparents died, everyone moved out and they rented the house. And people who rent houses don't give a fuck. Yeah. They just go ah, you know, I'll let I'll love the I'll let the uh, homeowners life. deal with that. And then they won't tell the homeowners, and then they won't deal with it. Yeah. yeah, and also the homeowner lived in Virginia, and mom wanted nothing to do with the house. You know, because so. she she had to deal with it for her yeah, entire life for, for, for fifty years. So, so she's, she's like, she's, I want to take a break now. Out of it, r- rightfully so. That's what I was looking. The term I was looking for. Um. Huh. But yeah. <laughs> so the new job. How was the training? What'd you I, do? Tell me, tell me. I things. hopped in the truck with like the trainer, and he goes, "There's like five spots over there. Just put it in one of them." I'm like, <laughs> just okay. put it in one of them. I'm like, all right. And I like, I totally botched the park. I completely botched it because there's super. It was a super single trailer. Yeah. So like, that's like their older trailers that run super singles, but not their tr- like their trucks and trailers used to be super singles. Okay. Weird. And then and then I'm used to the 43 foot. They're 40. Or no, 53 foot. They're only like 40, <laughs> 45 or 43 foot trailers. The tankers. Yeah. So yeah. you can turn much short. So the trainer was like, why do you take these so wide? And I'm like, bro, am I not supposed to? It's because it's a uh, solid axle in the rear. The, the tandems don't slide, right? No, ta- I do yeah, be no, like in the leachy. Yeah. yeah, I know, well, right? like, I'm just so used to having like that big ass fucking trailer behind me. Yeah, I don't blame you. Yeah. It's kind of scary. Like, there was a lot of like rollover safety Ooh, really? Yeah, okay. very I guess much. That makes thank sense. you, Chris. So, like, Art? you know half, you know half of all tanker rollovers are on straight roads. Yeah, isn't it like they get pushed over by wind or something? Do you want this? No, no. that's more drive. That's the drive. That's, that's the more drive. So wait, so how, how do they get rolled over by going straight? I don't know. That's why I was so, curious about. So there's no if you're running like fuel or something that doesn't have to be like super clean. You, there's baffles in it that help the front and forward, front to back surge. Okay, but. If you dip a tire off, is this like what you were telling me about? A little with bit. the ones on the side. Mm-hmm. So they have extra ones with ones on the front and back. What do you mean? Is that what he said? Is that baffles inside the tank? That's Th- what you were talking about with the ones on the side, right? What? Is that the same thing, or, you, or did you? I don't know. Remember when we were talking about how when you transport like explosive materials? Oh, you're talking about placards. It's got the things on the side. Placards. Yeah, those are placards. That's just a that's just to show if you get into an accident, what what material is potentially in the trailer. If it's a corrosive, if it's explosive. No, it's, no, no. It's it... not like a sign that says like what he's transporting. It's like bars. At least I thought this is how you were explaining it to me. Maybe I misunderstood, but it's like bars on the side of the tanks. I don't remember this conversation. It sounds like she's talking about like canards or something. No, like bulkheads. You just pulled that word weird. out of your bulkheads? ass. No, canards are the little flaps that you put on bumpers to make it more bars. more aerodynamic. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm talking about yeah, like bars, like poles, like bolt, like fucking. Okay, the only example I can come up with is you know, 
<laughs> I don't even know if you guys would know in this Back example, to the Future, but... where he falls, he grabs onto one of them. <laughs> no, 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 no. Like I was gonna use a, a probably a worse one, but like in when in gymnastics, like or whatever. Like if you're at, never mind. Just forget. It's I'm fine. So I'll just get out of it. Yeah, I'm also. Very She's confused. stuck on bars. They're like little little like triangle things that sit on either side of the tank. Like this is tank, right? This is tank. Uh huh. Yeah. And the on this side and on this side, tank is going this way. Yeah. On both of these sides, there's like little triangle things, and like it holds it in there. It holds it in place. I think those are concrete trucks. No, I know. No. I, I know what she's talking. I know what she's talking about. I don't know what she's talking about. You know, we literally. Had I, this conversation, I, I know what she's like, talking about. This week, I'm pretty sure. I'm I know pretty she's sure we had Justin, this conversation this week. Cylinder. Yes. Has to attach to a flat bottom. The little triangles that hold it in place. <laughs> Holy I'm, shit! I, I'm still how so is, lost. How was that any different from what I was saying? I just you you're saying like you're, the little you're saying like the little wedges that they used to yes, hold. Yes, 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 yes. They're talking about on a flatbed trailer when you have a tank on it and it has the bars around it. Do you know what I'm oh. talking? Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 See, no, that's what it is. That's not at all what I'm hauling. You just have you got to explain to him like he's a dumbass. Because I am a dumbass. No, so like instead no, of like, I think I don't just, even go I layman's think... terms. Just go triangle circle and he'll figure it out. <laughs> <laughs> that's why I drive a that's, truck, baby. That's why you gotta spe- you gotta specify the flat. Okay, never mind. Because if, if not, yeah. you, he just goes on a flatbed. Easily got that. Yeah. yeah, that's what but, I do now. So no, no, no. So my my the trailers that I pull are just like the tanker. There is no flatbed. It is a tank. What with does it wheels. sit on? It's its own trailer. Huh? Picture. Picture. Oh God, you 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 lost her. You broke her. Picture. Uh, hello. <laughs> Oh man! You, so, you should so, definitely title this podcast. Yeah, big trucker guys. Okay, I like that. That's a good. That's a good episode name. Do you have that TikTok? We love my phone. Do you have that TikTok I sent you? Yeah, I'll I'll show her that. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's perfect. I'll have the thumbnail be <laughs> the bubbles going everywhere. Anyway, the bubbles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so they flip over because if you if you like accidentally dip a tire on the shoulder and you go to correct it really hard, the it'll sur- like the liquid will surge one way, surge the other, and you go to correct. From the smaller one, and then all like forty thousand pounds of liquid will just go to one side and flip you over. This is what he's driving. I know exactly. I know exactly what you're talking. But there's about. no flat part. It's there's just like, nothing on the bottom of that. No, it's just no. the tank. This is what you're driving. Yeah. Yes. Dang. Yes. And then, and then you're. Do you have crazy. ones with the uh, the socks on them? <laughs> no. So no? so so socks, so that huh? is insulated. It's Yo, it's under the chrome. Oh. So our tankers are much smaller realistically. I've but been like fighting the, with this this. The big outside is the like, it's drooping down. I. I think I just sat up and it was positioned. For and me so, if you want, you could tighten it. Like, how do I tighten it? Uh, the thing on, yeah, yes. you have to really crank on it because go, go uppies. Those are a- those are Amazon basic fucking stands, and they're not. <laughs> they're, well, they're, they're not good. They ain't the best. They fifty dollars each. It's fine. It's fine. Nice. I'll just... You know what's funny? I have a lav microphone that, much better, that you could just kind of clip to your shoulder. I mean, clip to your. Well, you don't have it. See, I thought you were talking about okay, this Okay, every time this I'm on triangles. the podcast, I'll just clip it to my hair. Every time I'm on the podcast, I want one of those, please. Okay. Yeah, I mean. I thought you were talking about this triangle. Placards? No. You're trying to wear a placard? How These was triangles. that when I was explaining it all? Uh, Show uh, the camera. Oh, no. Show the camera. Just, can I get a dramatic me. zoom? Just send Chris the... You're welcome for the editing. Just, I don't know what time we're at, but you're... Send Chris the image, no? Okay, regardless. Oh, yeah, send the image. No. Oh, yeah, more editing, eh? That's just... I already don't. Nick's the only one who edits episodes. I don't fucking do that. You send this to Nick? No, no. He's the only one who puts extra stuff. I just take stuff out. Uh, okay. <laughs> if they go, hey, put up, put up this photo. I go, fuck you. I don't put um, that shit up. But I, I, I might. <laughs> I might figure it but out. Like you, you know what she's talking about, right? Like where they put the tanker on the flatbed and yeah, yeah. Like when it's coming out of port, yeah. pretty much. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. yeah. With That's the, the triangle, conversation with we were the having. triangles about coming out of the port. Yeah, I, I remember now. This motherfucker. I Never need mind. to. Uh, I need to get I mean, my. I'm glad you remember now, but I need to get my TWIC to get card too. My Twic card. Your Twic card. What's I'm getting. That? I'm getting that for my job too. Twic card. Because we. I run the port. What is that? Oh, Your so Twic you deliver card? gas to people? Twic card is for or the, whatever uh, else they ports. get in the port. Yeah, is it like specific to truck drivers or just like anybody no, that no, like has to go into the? You can get one. Yeah. Like I think sec- my mom has one. Like security. She definitely does. Security. 100%. Maybe it needs sounds one. familiar. It's, yeah, I guarantee you if you ask your mom, do you have your Twic card? She'll be like, yeah. It also, 100%. my mom's got I think all it, the cards. I think it also mm. works. Does it work for TSA don't pre-check or am I? Do that, I guess. Does it work for TSA pre-check or am I faded? I don't think no, it should, right? Don't don't sign up for tri- TSA pre-trip. Sign up for eyeglass. I think it's called that. You mean it's, clear? Is it clear? 
clears like the, the uh, circle with the dots. You literally go up and they scan your eyes and then they scan. They have all your information and you skip the line. That's yeah, fire. That's, what, uh, that's, that's clear. fire. Clear that yeah, too. clear. I almost got that working with Schneider. Like the, the fucking dude at the airport. The line was long. He goes, hey man, sign up for this. Yeah, it's clear. free. Hey, Chris, blah, blah, blah. We'll scan your eyes you know what you need? and put all your information. The only reason I didn't get that is because my damn CDL doesn't scan. Yeah. So he couldn't scan. Um, no, I was going to say you need one of those little box fans. Yeah. Oh, yeah, you definitely need a box for that. I'm going to change so, my shirt. I used to have a fan, and it used to be over there, like but my dad shirt. took it for work. Fine. Also, uh, our plans have changed, so, I think. What the fuck? What are our plans now? What the fuck? Just imagine how good this is going to be when it's cold for the two weeks out of the year. <laughs> Bro, we got to wait so long for that. <laughs> I know, dude. Oh, yeah. I get that two weeks out of the year. Dude, those two weeks out of the year, podcast every day. Fuck. Christ. Was that the fence? Yeah, I kind of oh. whacked up into it. I was like, I thought so that was the Luca, door. Lucas, I, I continue. I was see <laughs> the, the trucks are nice. Your, they're, tra- your they're trainer's tra- out in Hollywood? Yeah. Cool dude. Here's a dog. Hollywood. So you're leaving Monday. He got yep. Borker. He uh, was like, was like, damn, bro, you want him on the top bunk? Big motherfucker. <laughs> in the middle of the office, bro. That's <laughs> fucked up. I can't believe he said that to your ass. Yeah. Have you been in the top bunk? No. Your truck didn't have a top bunk? Oh, no, it did. Never went on you it. You never went on it? Nope. It's good. Kinda, it's kind of nice. Storage. I put I put a uh, $500 worth of illegal fireworks on my top bunk. I just put fucking what hoodies and fuck? shit up there. That yeah, I, I remember 4th of July at my house last year. Yeah. Yeah, those were all illegal here. Um, I bought them in New Mexico. It's uh, only illegal if you get caught, though. Yeah. Texas. Hypothetically. <laughs> in Minecraft. I'm talking about Minecraft, babe. Oh, yeah. y- you find out that... You can make bunk beds you, in Minecraft? No, that you can get arrested for saying in Minecraft now. Really? Why? Yeah. Because the FBI figured it out. Oh. Fucking bastards. <laughs> Same Mexico. The FBI's like, this yeah, we're on we're ago. on to you. So now we have to use... Of limitations. Now we got to use I, Roblox I, or something. I fibbed Roblox. when I said something. last year. I meant 10, 15 years ago. <laughs> yeah. When I was a wee lad. When you were yeah. fucking 15. When you were playing Minecraft a lot? Yeah, obviously. Does that count? If I say I'm playing Minecraft? Yeah. Maybe. I mean, well, I don't know. Fuck the feds. Wow. <laughs> hey, yo. In Minecraft. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. So what? So what? We both get two grand, like, so right away? You, like, kiss uh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You have to wait for your sign-on bonus, cowboy. I get the two grand. <laughs> Dang. If, if I... Did, if you, did you get a sign-on bonus? Yeah. Wait, so what do you... What does that job entail? Is that, like, more... I drive... Country driving? I yeah. drive a big truck. So you're gonna leave again? On the back. Nah, just hypothetically, I was asking questions. So, like, if first you're, of all, Justin quit that job because of you. If, so, if it's you're not a, true, see, don't put that in her head see, because now she's gonna. Thanks, no, man. because I don't like you're that. Just inflated her I don't ego. like that. We had a long conversation about that, we and did. I did not want him to come back home for me. He he hated that. it on the road. I did. Apparently, it was not fun. I mean, it's but the pay was good. It's cool. It's fun. I, you get to see the country. Arizona. No, I can't, you know, no, no one, honestly, not honestly, many people can anything say anything in the I, Northeast I, is beautiful. Fuck, fuck yeah. the Southeast. Southeast sucks. Not many people my age can say they did what I did. It was great. I had a fun time. It just was Lucas super Stan. stressful. I said, I'm not, sorry. He said, not, not many. Sorry. I said, not many. <laughs> it's the two. It was obviously it was not a part of that. Stre- not many. It, don't, it's stressful, right? Oh, I, I'm, I'm worried about going out with the tank. Yeah. I'm, I am stressed well, out you, about going out well, with the tank. Not to say you did less work, but. You did reefers. I did multi-million dollar loads. Yeah, but I had like four hundred thousand dollars worth of meat. <laughs> That's a lot of meat that had to be did kept. You in, have, that had you to be kept what? negative ten. <laughs> Why Beans. Did you have to say it like- <laughs> meat. Did you have armed guards at your drop-off points? No. Yikes! For real. Just I had like, armed guards at every Siva Logistics. Why is this the first time I'm hearing about that? I've never told you. No, oh, what the it's just something that he doesn't care to share. I guess. I had armed guards. He with like does air. not talk to me about the other. I had armed Schneider job. Very armed much. guards. I don't know if I was supposed every, to drop that. It's fine. I worked for Schneider National. Bro, and he had, quit. I was on a Siva Logistics yeah. account. He said full name. My Drop driver it. number he was says, one one eight, eight, eight name five seven times six. When he said some very, it was your truck number. He said some very questionable uh, things about three her. five five four oh, five. I could say a lot of no, questions. Is that on the original truck or is that on the rental? The rental. So I, don't, so, I, don't, I think I we could all say very was. bad things about our exes. But I leave it alone because fuck that motherfucker. Like how Any, one anyways. ex accused me of rape. Yeah. When anyways, when we're not going to talk about that. He said when I was a virgin. When I was a virgin. I remember that. That was real. You wish you got a butt lift. Yeah, I know. 
<laughs> and then my two best friends went to her 15th birthday party. Ew. This was before or after the butt lift? This was, <laughs> this was before the butt lift. Because the butt lift would justify the going. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. He, um, he raped me. I'm a virgin. <laughs> what are you talking about? Shut up. Sorry. Armed guards. <laughs> Sorry. There was armed guards at every pickup and drop off. Uh, I broke down right outside of Texas in Oklahoma. I was on a high value account, which was different from, or high value load, which is different from every other load. High value was anything above $12 million. That I know about. Um, since it was a high value account or high value load, I had an app called Overhaul where I had to call someone, tell them my load, tell them my truck number, my full name, my license number, my truck number, uh, tell them where I was at, how long I was stopping, and when I was leaving. So I did all that, but then, I, you know, I'm not leaving. I'm broke down. Three out of four of my airbags on my trailer busted. So I need, I, I need someone. Where was this? In Oklahoma? Yeah, right outside of Texas. Did you tell me this story before? Probably. This but doesn't sound familiar. I remember you breaking down in Ohio. Or... I broke, the, yeah, that's when my truck exploded. Yeah. Um, this was. Lost the motor? No. Just the D, DPF. DP, D, DEF. That's the word. DEF system blew up and, the, and uh, other stuff. That and what, when they were working on it, they're like, oh, yeah, your rockers, they're on call, uh, recall. So we're going to pull the motor. And I was like, huh, okay. For the rockers? Yeah, because the head was underneath the chassis. The cab. Yeah, and yeah. it's easier to pull it than lift the cab, which makes no sense. I would lift the cab. I don't know. Whatever. Dude, is, um, isn't it crazy that Justin may or may not have radiated items in Ohio right now? Radiated? No, oh, you need a hazmat to pull radiation loads. I had a hazmat uh, permit. Yeah, no. but you're not. But it's not a. No, it's I, not the same. I, it's you, it's you, not. You it's not the on the level of hazmat endorsement. But I still hold ha- hazmat loads technically. Yeah, batteries. It was just a percentage of the load was hazmat. Therefore, I had the permit. Yeah. Anyways, on that breakdown, since it was a high value load, I had to make a phone call and tell them, "Hey, I broke down." Within the hour, there was an armed guard next to me. For the day and a half, I was broken down. The dude would not talk to me. Ooh, That's so hey, creepy. He's not getting paid to hi- talk to you. He's paid to guard. He had a pistol on him and an AR on his chest. Nice. Dang. When He came ready for when, the shits. When the, what were you hauling? Uh, that's the thing. I was never told what I was hauling. They're really expensive electronics. He's hauling iPhones. Yeah. <laughs> um, iPhones. When I was broken down on that load, the technician came out from fucking like 60 miles away. He diagnosed the problem. He goes, dude, we don't have any parts for another like day. And I'm like, well, clearly you can see it's a high value load. I can't tell you what's in it. Also, I don't know what's in it. So if you could like upcharge me and fast pace this, Schneider has no problem paying the bill. And he was like, I got you. He drove 200 miles to go get stuff same day. Damn. And fix it. Nice. Well, Still took good. him a day and a half. That guy got a mad check. He, I did, signed did he tell off you on broke? the bill. Huh? Did you tell you it broke? Yeah, three of the airbags on the trailer. Oh, yeah. Three out of four. That's what? So wild. it wouldn't let you drive? I could have. It would have been sketchy and dangerous. Yeah, it's like I driving them, with no I was like, shocks. it's not safe. And they were like, Can, are you sure you can't make it? I'm like, I have 800 miles to go. That's a shift and a half for me. No. Yeah. I'm yeah. not doing that. They tried to push that load on me. And I was like, no, I'm not doing it. I don't care if you lose money. I don't care if I lose money. I'm not doing it. And I lost money on it. You're eh. being really spicy right now. I'm sorry. I'm that, not that, the reason no. that that happened. I'm not mad at you. I'm just pissed <laughs> off at Siva Logistics. He's Schneider, remembering I'll work old, for Schneider old, again. Old, 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 bad he's, memories. He's, I'll work PTSD for Schneider. is kicking his ass right now. Hundred, yeah, it is. I'll work for Schneider again. I won't ever do a Siva Logistics account. I might. I thought about going to Schneider after my stint here. Just because I want to do flatbed. And I know they'll pay me for flat, like good for flatbed. They'll pay you real good for flatbed. Yeah. Well, because if You're I own nearly a dollar a mile. Yeah. If I own a op. Oh. Um, oh yeah. damn! If I own a op, I want a flatbed. Oh, hundred percent. They a, have really good owner op programs. Fuck a van. No. Man, I want my own truck. Uh, I had yeah, but you can lease through them. Like Trans Am does. Yeah, but Trans Am shit's a scam. I mean, so they're all scams. You might as well go third party and do it on your own. But like, yeah, you, you I mean, qualify a hundred percent of the time with Schneider. You don't. Have, no, don't you don't even need to sign a contract. Pre emissions truck, eight hundred horsepower, twin turbo cat, thirteen speed. You can do that with Schneider. Oh, just no cab overs. That's fine. I don't want to fucking cab. I don't want to die. <laughs> I fucking <laughs> hate you. cab overs. Thank you. 
I had a client work for Schneider, and I told them that he worked for Schneider. Yeah. And he said, fuck Schneider. I would literally rather die than go back to that company. <laughs> Can we talk about how Justin may or may not have radiated items in Ohio? You keep on saying that, man. Because he doesn't know. What radiated items? So. What do you mean? Justin's truck broke down in Ohio. Is it the do- for the dolphin people underground? Uh, what? The lizard men. No, okay, so Justin's truck broke down in Ohio. True or false? Correct. That is true. There's a, there's a, recently, I, recently, it was like a month ago. Uh, the, tra- the train, the train, talk. the train <laughs> derailed in Ohio and they had to do a chemical berm. That doesn't mean it was in the same fucking, and it no, also wasn't Ohio radiation. Is. Yeah, but I would love to think that somewhere just Justin sitting there in a field that you're saying one that of Justin's Justin shirts that, that he's owned and he's bought with his money got some radiation on it. It's got some kimmies on it. I drove through Ohio like a few days after that. Yeah. Then he might be irradiated. <laughs> yeah, like Dude. I was actually in that town that blew up. Like yeah. I, I've crossed over those exact trains. I, I did the research. I don't remember, but I, I did the research you, at the time. Do you know what interstate it was near? Dude. So I did I-90 and I-80 and I-70 through there. I don't know. Did does your GPS route you through a lot of small towns in Ohio? Um, if I had to get, I never stopped in Ohio, so no, never oh. really. I, I was, was in going Ohio to. a lot. I was going to once, but, uh, fucking. They Ma- my mainly trip. Northwest Ohio in Obets. Northwest. Northwest. The only time I got, no, I didn't even stop in Ohio. Bro, I fucking stopped in like Gary, Indiana, like four bro, times. Bro, the fact, I was about to bring up <laughs> Gary, Indiana. We, we were on a phone call and he goes, bro, I'm in Gary, Indiana. And I got so mad that he was in Gary, Indiana. <laughs> Because Gary, Indiana's the shithole of fucking Indiana. Wait, it it's, it's totally so bad. It's Wait, so, why? I don't know why. <laughs> Just there, there's, there's an OC for Schneider, an operating center in Gary, Indiana. Yeah. I swear to God, it's in the shit. It's in like Compton of Indiana. It's <laughs> terrible. Compton? It's like cobblestone awful. brick fucking roads to get there. And you're in a semi. Yeah, you got air ride suspension and air ride seats. It's still like you you're sink? in a slam Civic driving there. Yeah. It's so bad. Just fucking bouncing everywhere. So it was hilarious I because I was telling him about how I was trying to stop at the pilot there. And we had the same experience trying to get to that fucking pilot. It's a bitch, dude. So I missed the initial turn. I was mm-hmm. like, I was like, there's no way this is a truck. This is way too sharp of a turn. And there's a TA across the street. And I just didn't feel like parking Thank at you, the love. TA. Brother, I turned down a street and like, I shit like not even like 20 feet down this road. No trucks allowed. Yeah. <laughs> They tell you when you're on the street. Yeah. Like, huh? What do you, what do you, what do you mean no trucks allowed? <laughs> I got duffies. So I I, so I, I got out of Thank my truck love. after I like made a U-turn I through like that sketchy. Dude, I sunk about half of my steer tire into the dirt. Really? Ooh, that's I never good. Like yeah, like Dang, like, I, like, like the whole hair? tire. I, my rim almost touched Listen, the mud. Yeah, I sunk my whole fucking steer tire in the dirt, in the mud, in the mud trying cool. to turn around. Other than that, I, I fucking love, bro, like there's a little food spot in there I went like to that, three times. I stopped at Gary, Indiana three times no. out of the four times I went through. <laughs> yeah. That's so Just funny. to get food from there. It was I, okay. so good. I stopped at a little mom and pop shop uh, in Texas. I think it was El Paso, Texas. Here, and so. bro, every time I was there, it's like I've been there 15 years. Legal, Just legal, dead. Legal, legal, good to see. Nice. Bro, I went there four times, four or five times. The first time I go, like, oh, what's your name? Blah, blah blah. I remember everyone who comes here. I'm like, this guy's fucking joshing me. I eat his Stop. fucking breakfast burrito. Dude, this is the best food ever. Can I give you more money? That's the best meal I've had in a week. And he goes, nah, nah. I'm like, where's your tip jar? He goes, I don't have one. I'm like, here's twenty dollars. Thank you so much. <laughs> I did that. Too. I, I happen to come <laughs> back the next week. I'm like, I'm back. And he's like, Justin. I'm like, you remember me? Yes. Yeah, yeah, he wasn't no. lying. It was so good, dude. That uh, that happened to me when I was in Jersey. Okay, I dropped off at. See, I dropped off at like this cute. Porky, I think is the name of the plant, and I was so tired. I like I went to a, to a Conco or something like that. Um, oh, no, hard ass truck stop to pull into. I barely pull into the one of the pumps, and I'm just like, ah. Oh. I, I was stumble inside. I get this fresh know, homemade, fucking uh, Philly cheesesteak. I was so happy. We're at 44 this minutes. The happiest I've Pog. been so long. There's no way it's been 44 minutes. Yeah, it's 44 minutes. You, have you been to a? Uh, I think you have Quick Trips. Up in uh, yes. like Wisconsin and shit. Okay, I haven't been to a quick trip in Wisconsin, but I went to a quick. I stopped at a quick trip in Georgia. What are you guys freaking nah, out about over there? It's not the same. What happened? Is it Lizzie? Bro, wait, wait. No. Is it quick trips or is it something trips? Oh, a roach. Yeah, real real trips. There was one on the garage door earlier. What? There was something of quick something trips. trips. It's something quick trips. trips. QT. I think red. So. Yeah, it's red. Yeah. 
strips. They have amazing pre-made pastas. Oh really? Oh dude. I should have so good. I got those I and tried. I got I bought all their veggie like uh carrots, uh broccoli and celery like packs yeah. with ranch. I bought like eight of them. I where did I yo wait wait. wait. What I was gonna say is fucking you wait, you ever been in Minnesota? Ranch. You never see vegetables on the road, bro. Yeah. I'm Not just, good ones either. I'm just talking shit. How dare you? She holds her hand. <laughs> I can't fucking believe you. I can't wait, believe you're me. cooking them for ranch? I'm confused. <laughs> what? I don't know. Honestly, ranch. I just tuned back. I'm gonna, in push, and that that's I heard eight pan- eight, gonna push that bubble button. Eight pants. Eight. You're gonna push the what? Eight pants. Eight pants of ranch. What are you doing? Eight packets of eight ranch. Eight pants oh, of did ranch. You knock my beer over. That's, that's your beer. beer. Yes. Goober. Your shirt says beer. It does. Oh, I got boobles on me. Um. Anyways, do you want to know what our plane? Our plane? Yeah. What are our plans now? Oh, because I haven't court- heard. Mm. Hello. Holy fucking mm. shit! Mm. English is hard. Um, wait, wait. Mi- Minnesota is just elevated Ohio. I'm sorry, what the fuck did you just <laughs> Dude, I'm so glad we got that with all the bubbles. Oh, my God. <laughs> You're right. Me, bro, You're right. And I don't like that. Cause bro, I had one load in, in Minnesota, and I fucking I did fucking go up this steep ass mountain, and I got up there, and I was like, "Yo, this is just fucking farmland with like little hills. It's Ohio, <laughs> all over again." <laughs> let, you know, let them sit with. Have him. you been to South Dakota yet? No, I didn't have to go through there. It's about the same. Did you just give really? me a sandwich and no fries. <gasps> yeah, <laughs> it's it was really funny. I I was on some mountain back road. I want to learn. I want to know about our plans first, actually, before I forget. What are What are we doing? Well, I'll talk about it afterwards. Okay. I'll let you know what the fuck the, the, there are plans. Um, I was Continue on. Continue your trucker here, conversation. Here, here was the main highway. You know, cut in between mountains and blah blah blah. Mainly straight. Mainly not up and down hills. And then about 500 feet left was like a mountain road. That just, it was still straight, but up ups and downs. Did you put a heart on it? Um, yeah, I, I put a little heart on the downs. cap. Schneider, it's a little disformed now because I grabbed it from the top. But. Schneider routed me, not the main highway. I'm gonna take a picture the mountain of road. It, even though it's upside down. In in and fucking deformed. South Dakota. <laughs> and I, I'm I'm like I I hit uh the zoom out button oh, on my GPS lid? just once, and I see the main highway. And every now and then, you know, when the hills do crest down, it? I just see the main highway flat. I feel it made like your no v sense. Is too deep. That's funny. Probably made no fucking sense. That's. Uh, I mean, dude, the fucking like that's. Wait, I ran two on. GPSs when I drove. I ran the, my ELDs and I ran um <laughs> trucker my path. trucker path on my phone. God, isn't it the best app? Dude, ever? It's, fuck, it's awesome. I love that you can also have you set it up to like you can also get WalMarts and Targets and yes. Best Buys. Okay, good. Yeah, because oh, well, dude, if I have to, my favorite schedule when I was running was like I'm get up at three it. and I start running at three. Fuck was that? Your neighbors are being obnoxious. I ran over something. Totaled my car. Can you guys tell me the funniest trucker story that you've uh, had that's, a lot, ha- that's happened to you? Maybe I had a lot lizard knock on my door in Atlanta. You had a lot lizard? Yeah. I had a lot lizard. What the fuck yeah. is a lot lizard? A whore. Oh. A lot lizard's a whore that hangs out in truck stops. Sleeper leapers. Sleeper, Sleeper leapers. Sleeper leapers. Lot lizards and um. That's not back to Christopher. Fuck. There's another. Is one your full name Christopher? Yes. Yeah. With like a PH or an F? A uh, PH. Okay. Good. I don't the know correct. a Christopher that's spelled with an F. I do. You know, know Lucas's full name? Lucas is short for something. Luciano. <laughs> yeah, Luciano. I don't know. I thought of the first long L name. That's uh, not that I'm lying to you. Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry. No, but do you do you really want to fuck Whatever, her up? I threw out a good name. Do you re- no? Do you really want to like really blow her mind? Sure. Do you know what Justin's full name is? She does. I do. What's it? What is it? Drop it. Government. Go, full government name and everything, baby. We talked about this like four Oh my god, days wait, ago. I know. It's Justin. Already wrong. Shut up. Hello. It's Justin. Already wrong. His first name's Justin. Nope. The fuck do you mean? Not his name. I don't what know. the fuck is I don't know what name? he knows. What do you know? Not his name. Okay. His first name's Justin. Nope. What is it? Justin Fur? Nope. I don't. I don't get this either. I don't. I don't Just to be clear, I, I, I guess I'm the only one who knows this. His name's actually supposed to be Chris. I'm supposed. To oh be yeah. Well, yeah. I'm, su- I'm supposed to be Justin. Yeah. yeah, I knew that. But his name's fucking Justin. And our middle names are switched. He was supposed to be Tyler, and I was yeah. supposed to be Thomas. But now we're swapped. Okay. 
okay. I was really I'm, off there. Who last names, my, I mean. Who yeah. has your dad? Your mom? Your dad? What's your, what are your parents? What? My dad's also Th- Thomas. Thomas. Is your mom Lee? No, no one's Lee. Who the fuck is Lee? Julia. 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 Julia Lee Murphy. She's family. What the fuck? No. no oh, I'm so Lee. bad. Julia's middle name isn't Murphy. It's Catherine. Sorry. With a K or a C? K. It's a good one. Yeah. <laughs> I only know that because my favorite, one of my favorite games is Catherine. It starts with a K. That's a good game. Wait. It might start with a C. Oh, it's, no. It's with a C. <laughs> oh, Yo, Chris hey, is here from the doghouse, bro. Oh, no. Chris is from the doghouse. Oh, dog I'm so house, bad. Sure. That's, the, that's, it's I, so that's why I remember because it's, one, it's one, one of my yeah. favorite games, Catherine. So uh, that's why I know her middle name. My, Fuck, my dude. cousin's name. Wait, really? Catherine. What's your sleeper leaper name? <laughs> my sleeper leaper name? Yeah. Oh, God. Do you have one? No. Uh, mm. <laughs> I, I only ran into... Uh, tell me your sleeper leaper story. I don't really have one. There was one. There's a sleeper leaper in the truck stop that me and Alberto stopped at before oh, we yeah. came home. Wait, what was the other name that you called sleeper leapers? It was way funnier than sleeper leaper. Oh, uh, lot lizards. Oh, maybe sleeper leaper. Was sleeper leaper is the better one. <laughs> it smells yeah. like popcorn. It does. They probably just made popcorn. No, but to roll back real quick. Yeah, I have cab, one. Cab had, crawler. Cab crawler. Cab That's what it crawler. is. Cab crawler. Um, I had sleeper. one knock on my window, and I was like. What the fuck Just is a crab crawler? This? Another hole? Yeah, another no, hole. It's another hole? name. Another hole? Honestly, yeah, that's I'm what they got. I'm not even going to lie to you. I'm leaving. What? No worries. Don't even, don't okay. even worry about it, Chief. Just the, the, um, the do, wait, did your Did your truck have emergency exits on both sides of the sleeper? Yes. Uh, mine only had one. Um, I'm going to pour this out right there. Emergency on both sides? No, only on no, only passenger on the passenger side. side. Yeah, 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 same. When when the Trans Am trainer was going around and showing us the the car, he goes, he goes, "This is the door you kicked the sli- the, the the lot lizards out of," and you and you literally go flicked it open and it popped right open. And all the whole fucking like the the guys of us who got there, the, the the ones of us who got the job was all fucking cracking up laughing. That's funny. Yeah, Trans Am. I honestly would have stuck there if they fucking paid me better. They paid me like dirt. <laughs> Yeah, you, what, like 38, 34? 31. 31. Oh, my God. Really? Yeah. I mean, like, I was on the brink of getting a raise. Was I? No, that's a lie. No, I would have had, had like, another two months or something. I had, like, another six weeks if I wanted to get a raise. Yeah, but still, like, what would they what would they bump you up to? Fucking, fucking 40? 40? 40? Oh, my God. That's not it. That ain't Dude, I'm it. making more money in training with this company than I am a tra- <laughs> Yeah, no, that. Bro. Hey, turn the, that mic the other way training, so it doesn't pick us up. Training for this company is $150 a day. Oh my god, that's better than Schneider. Yeah, it's great. Schneider was eighty bucks a day plus food per diem, but like the I, food was provided, it wasn't cash. Oh okay, no, I didn't get food per diem. The only thing they paid for for me was like breakfast. For I got days, breakfast. Which... I got lunches. Breakfast? I got the best fucking what, deli what, subs. Did they put you in a nice hotel? Yeah, it was in a bad area though. Oh, okay. I, you walk out of it. I walk across the street, and homeless dudes would harass me for blue pills. Nice fentanyl. Oh, awesome. not yeah, Viagra? They were, like, they were like, got any, poo- got any blues? And I uh, sheltered Vlad, and I was like, Viagra? And he was like, nah, inward. And I was like, okay. And then my buddy's like- Was he dude. white? No, he was black. Oh, okay. Um, And then my, my buddy Gunther, who I met there, this really big dude who did like MMA for years, was like, hey, 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 and like pushed me away. And he was like, he, he like yelled at the homeless dude, like, back off, man. Like, go away. We don't, no, go, go away. Turns out the dude's body language was like signaled him to like he was about to fucking knock me out, and nice. I was just like, "Huh? What? No, I don't have any Viagra. Viagra. <laughs> like, uh, and I don't I, have any boner pills." And I, I was just like so lost. Like, I, I, I don't know. The dude was apparently about to hit me, and Gunther saved me. And I was like, "He looked fine to me." And he goes, "Nah." He put his foot back and like clenched his fist, and I was like, "He was about to rock your shit." Okay. Rock. About to rock your socks. And then literally five minutes later, I was walking in front of him. I was wearing a tank top, which I never do. Uh, yeah. But it was Arizona, 115 degrees. Yeah. Um, and he was like, "I don't know why I saved you. Your fucking shoulders are broad as shit." And I was like, "Nah, I just walk very straight forward." And he goes, "Huh? What the fuck does that mean?" <laughs> I have great posture when I when I stand, when I, when I sit, I'm like terrible I'm posture. like this. This for once I have good I have posture. Terrible standing like posture. If, I, if I if I sit, I'm normally just like this, bro. Yeah. Dude, you it's know what's bad. funny? I only have good posture when one I go to sleep, and two when I yeah sta- no shit you're laying down when I stand up. What do you mean? Terrible. What's your what's bad posture sleeping? 
Fucking you. How do you sleep, Justin? <laughs> yeah, you know what? You got me. This man sleeps in a fucking ball like he's a fucking. <laughs> Wait, do you not sleep? He's still, a caterpillar I'm, going I'm a into side hibernation. Are you a side sleeper? I, I'm a side sleeper. I'm a side stummy sleeper. I've recently transitioned to a back sleeper. Oh, I wish. I wish I was a back I've sleeper. transitioned to a vampire sleeper. I, I lay like this. <laughs> I wish. I used to be a back sleeper. I and then, I, and then I got sleep apnea. I'm so now I can't breathe when I sleep on my I'm back. A, I'm a pillow. Hu- <laughs> I'm a pillow hugger. Yeah. I'll be, so I'll am be I. Sleeping with Dom, cuddle like spooning her, and then I'll roll over and I'll hug a pillow. That's <laughs> dude. That is me every night. I give Julia I the hour, and maybe hour and a half of, of cuddles, and then I'm like, okay, body pillow. Mm. Dude, I I, I well, didn't I, I didn't do it for like the longest time. Like, it's like, like eight months into well, no, like six months into the re- relationship, I didn't hug a pillow. Like when we slept. One day I was like, I can't fucking sleep. I need to hug a pillow. And I hug a pillow. She woke up. She thought I was mad. <laughs> like, they always think you're mad. They always think you're, it's like, no, bro. I, like me personally, I can't, I can't fall asleep cuddling someone. I, I can. It gets too hot. If I, sorry, mom, don't listen. I can if I've just fucked. That's even You did not give me. mom enough time to fucking exit. Whatever, <laughs> whatever, man. She doesn't watch these. There, if, if, not, dude, if I, if I just gotten my nut off. If I've just gotten my nut off and it's been like a long day to begin with, or I'm like kind of drunk, where is it? I'll I'll oh, I can't, I'll okay. get that, you know, and then uh Dude, I cuddle warm. and I'll just knock the fuck out. I'm too like I'm like warm because you know have to do all the effort. So, <laughs> um, that's why I got never mind. <laughs> Whoa! Uh, X- hey, Xbox, record that. <laughs> um, dude, I, I just can't like I'll cuddle and then like I'm like, are you asleep? And I try to like sneak my arm out. And then I just grab a pillow and I knock out. <laughs> Dude, I'm gonna be honest. It's there sometimes when Julie is just like, just, just, just go over there. Just go. It's too hot. Oh, yes. And I'm like, yeah, I'm yeah. Like, I do that bet. all the time. Please. Yeah. Like, Especially I, in this here's house, the thing. bro. It sucks. I, all right. Are you guys this specific, though? I can only sleep on my right side. No. Nah. I have to because my left shoulder is bad. Uh, wh- Whichever side is closer to the wall is which side I face. I used to be like that, but Dom's like, I'm sleeping towards the wall. She's on the wall side. I have to sleep by the by the like the edge of the bed because my bed's up against the corner yeah that sucks and i, I don't mind it but like man it kind of sucks when i'm uh, but it works out because i sleep on my right side and she's already facing the wall so she just faces the wall and it, it works out i hate when they it's, breathe in your face bro it's so annoying that it, yeah hey you know what's you know what you know what sucks <laughs> don't talk to me gosh i've elbowed julia or and like punched her in the face just, oh, just in the middle of the night. Because the there'll be times where I'll wake up and I'm like, I want to be on the left side. And I'll go and I'm like, all right, I'm going to put my hand over it. And I'll go. Dude. Just fucking whack her. Or like, or like I go too low. Like sometimes I'll try and go like this and I'll just go. Dude. And I'm like, oh my God, are you okay? And she goes. I'm like, oh my God, thank God she didn't wake <laughs> oh my up. Because I just fucking sleeper. elbowed she, you in the eye. Uh, no, no, she's not. She, but she wakes up and she's like, why this weird dream? You fucking smacked the fuck out of me. <laughs> The the first time yeah it was re- weird wasn't it the first time I slept at Dom's house and I fucking woke up yelling yeah I just had a bad nightmare bro nightmares I, are- I, and I, I I normally don't remember my nightmares I had a nightmare with she, with her in it which is arguably worse yeah um we were in a parking garage and the thing just collapsed on us Ooh. and I I just remember I me pulling her from her feet from underneath rubble not like crushing her but it was like damn close to yeah. like it was still going down or like like slowly cracking down mm-hmm. dramatically and shit so i i pull her out and then we're running down the stairs and her foot gets caught in like rebar part of the stairs that like collapsed mm-hmm. and i'm pulling her up by her foot and i just i remember that and then yelling i got you i got you and then i wake up yelling i got you i got you and she's like what the fuck is going on <laughs> and I'm like, huh? And then I, I had fucking tears in my eyes, bro. I was like, huh, 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 huh. I'm good. And it, like, I, I, one, I woke up from a nightmare. Two, I'm in a different environment. Three, there was a cat on me. Oh. And I'm just like, <laughs> yeah, huh? What the fuck is going on? It was, it was terrible, man. Dude, That's... I, I know they say everybody has dreams. And I, I very I'm, rarely remember mine. I'm I'm sure I do, but I don't remember any of my dreams. So to me, I go to sleep, and then it's I'm I'm up. And then I'm you up. wake up. Yeah. I'm up. Yeah, I'm the same way. And it's, I think it's genetics because so, mom mom barely ever sleeps. I don't know how dad ever sleeps. Either. I never ask him how he sleeps. Yeah, he always just wakes up and he's like another day. <laughs> yeah. So time to go it, plumb. Yeah. 
So it, it's literally when I have a nightmare, I'm like, dude, I had something last night. So it wasn't just fucking you just close wait, you, awake. You wake up with the emotions, right? No, like I, I, actually, if, if you if you have the nightmare, do you wake up with just like anxiety, depression, scared? Anything? No, I. So it's not that I'm scared. I'm sure I'm scared in the dream, but I wake up. I, the the emotions don't carry over. I'm not very. Not even for a second. I'm not a very emotional guy. I don't I know. know if you've noticed this, but my Trust emotions. Me, I know my emotions don't carry over that much. Okay, well, I'm an emotional lad. Yeah. And so, my but like, emotions carry over when I wake up. <laughs> I won't remember the dream, but I'll have anxiety. I'll be scared for like 45 seconds. I'm like, what the fuck? What? Huh? After dreams, a nightmare, I just dreams. wake up anxious. I don't See, know. when I wake up or from a nightmare, I'm happy. The fuck? Because oh, I because you're awake. Because I dreamed of something and I can remember it. I don't remember dreams. You know what? Yeah. I could, so I could if, I, if I wake up and I had a nightmare, I'm like, yeah, I had a nightmare, man. It wasn't fun, but yeah, I, I did something last night. You know what's the worst? Um, uh, sleep paralysis. I've never had that, but you've I have, had it like twice. I right? have quite a lot, actually. It's your sleep apnea. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> it, have you had sleep paralysis? No. Uh, do you know what it is? Kind of. So it's basically... Your body and your mind falling, your body falling asleep, but your mind is still awake. So you're basically in a coma, asleep, but you can still think everything. But the sometimes problem, you can open your eyes too and like see things. But yeah, your body physically can't. Move. Yeah, I I could open my see, eyes. See, but like I've and you can't move. I've had like, but you also hallucinate. Hallucinate. Woken up with what I think was waking up from a nightmare, and like I feel like I can't move. Not, I don't know if I've tried, but like I feel like I can't move. My eyes are open. And I'm like clearly very conscious, but like I don't move. Yes, that's, that's sleep apnea. Sleep paralysis. Sleep or paralysis. Apnea. That's sleep. That's no, sleep paralysis? that's sleep paralysis. Yes. Yeah. But, the, but like I never have the. But I. It's not like I, I don't try you, to move. You've though. just never gotten to the point where you're like, okay, I want to move now. Well, I have, and like occasionally, and I have been able to move. Or I, after, I, like, I'll sit there. I'm like, you seem pretty strongly minded you might be able to break it well no no no. so like uh, one of the times where i was like, I was like i've I was learned like, how to break it by i was like this has happened before i'm just Boners. gonna sit up and i sat up and i was like okay and passed <laughs> back out see i've had the last time it's happened to me it hasn't happened since i've had sleep paralysis so often to where i could i know the symptoms of when it's gonna happen so if i go to sleep and i'm thinking and like my mind so i don't know about you guys but when i go to sleep my mind is off it's just darkness, and then I go to sleep. Mine's always off. But if I go to sleep, and I'm thinking of something, and then I could feel myself slowly, it's going to sound bad, slowly slipping away, then I, I, have, sleeping I have to wake up. I have to watch something, or else I will get sleep apnea. Oh. The worst, the worst sleep apnea, I'll go with the second worst first, because the worst one is, in my eyes, the worst. One was terrible, because... I used to pile all my uh, all my dried clothes on my chair. So all my shirts, I used to stack on my chair. And on my computer, it would shine a light that would just be a constant light. It'd be a very dim light. And it would reflect off the chair onto the wall. But it would be so, so like it'd be a very, very like slightly darker shadow on the wall. Mm-hmm. And I call it the chair demon. I don't know why I do this to myself. <laughs> the, sh- the shadow on the wall, I'd be like, hey, chair demon, good night. And then I go to sleep. And there was one time where I woke up, and that chair demon is mad scary, and he's fucking looking at me funny. That was the second one. Sean. There was one where I was facing the wall, and I woke up, and I'm like, oh, I have sleep paralysis right now. But, I, but I'm but i facing the wall, so I can't see anything, so I can't hallucinate. I'm good. And Julia's right in front of me. So I'm like, so I'm good. And then I start hearing something. <laughs> I start hearing, like, a girl humming. And I'm like, it's just Julia in her seat. And then she's, like, singing. And I'm like, oh, well, I, you know, I can't really make it out, so I'm good. Then it gets really clear, and I'm like, okay. I mean, it's she's just it's just a girl singing. I'm okay with this. I could it's far away. It's on the other side of my room. I'm good. And then it's getting closer, and then I'm like, okay, now this is a problem. If it gets any closer, I'm gonna freak out. And it's like right here in my ear, and I I feel like something going through you my hair, feel, oh god, like like combing my hair, and I got long hair. So now I'm like, okay, this is a problem. I have to wake up now. And I found out how to do it. So what you want to do, you know how like you try to like yell or like you try to wiggle? Yeah. Yeah, no. What you want to do is tense up just as hard as you can. And you give yourself a leg cramp. 
oh, ew. And then you wake up with a leg cramp. So then you go, bam, immediately awake, leg cramp. So you want to cause some sort of pain towards yes, yourself. Yes, that's, hey, that's the only way I can find out, find a way to get out of it. I'm going to hopefully remember so that. So you just tense up, I just tense up super bad, and if I tense up enough, since I'm on my legs every day, they're already sore. Yeah. And so if I, if I tense up hard enough, I'm going to get a leg cramp. Bam, immediately out of sleep. I just, like, compress it to my back. I just fucking sat up really fast. <laughs> Hey, I'm glad you got the willpower for that, but because I fucking don't. Are the girls outside? Um, no, I think I, I heard them talk. I think one of them left, but I don't. I don't even know how. I feel like we're pretty. We good. were at 44 minutes, probably 15 minutes ago. So I think it's time to wrap up. That's yeah, yeah, I think we're time to wrap Real up. Fast. We're not gonna check it, but fuck it. So hey, if you guys did like that, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Hey, we're we're almost close to 200. So if you like this, get us to 3,000 subs in six months, and I'll do something crazy. Oh no, if we, if we get it to, I think it was 666 subs, or maybe it was 1,000 subs, we're going ghost hunting. I'm down. Yeah, so. Nice. If you want to see that, get it up. Hey, and if you are listening to this on Spotify, since I know there's way more of you on there, come over to YouTube and give us a follow. And uh, we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, Later. I love you. Bye.